Hey everyone, I'm Natalie Minnick. Welcome to my channel. I am cleaning our kitchen today. I haven't been on my channel for a little while um, and I will get into that now. Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. I'm Natalie Minnick. I haven't been on here for quite some time. Um, I kind of took off the last month or so. I life just got busy, you know, with the holidays. My husband ended up getting a new position at work, which is all great. But, you know, with that, you kind of, you know, roles start changing. You know, responsibilities are changing. So it just started getting really hectic. And I needed to put some things aside just so I wasn't so overwhelmed. Um, and that's okay. I knew I still wanted to do my channel. I still want to be here. Um, I just needed to refigure out and not be so overwhelmed with everything. And let me tell you, my house has suffered from it. So I've done quite a bit of cleaning already without having the video on. Um, but I also um, want to start videoing again. So I don't know how consistent I'll be able to keep things, keep videos coming. Of course, I would love to be as consistent as possible. But I also wanted to send out videos and give you guys an update with what's going on. So that's what's happening in a nutshell with me. Um, and yeah, living life. So as you can see, my house has been pure chaos. I found these in the basement. How cute are these? They're like little Valentine's containers that I was gonna use for my kids' lunches. Um, anyways, so yeah. That's that. I'm gonna be cleaning our kitchen. My oldest son is at preschool. I have him in there until one. And then my youngest goes in as well on Tuesday, Thursdays. So um, I figured I will clean as much as I can in an hour. And then I want to play with my youngest son who's entertaining himself right now, which is so cute. Um, so that is my plan. And for all the parents out there, <laughs> you know that even though you have a plan, doesn't mean it's 100% gonna work out. Like, I don't know if my son's really gonna entertain himself for an hour. But those are goals. And that's, it's good to have goals. So, anywho, let's start cleaning. And I'll throw some music on here and let's clean together and comment. If you're ever getting overwhelmed, 100% message me. We can chat about it. Um, I'll give you my tips and tricks. Obviously, I let things go. <laughs> So, you know, I haven't been keeping up with the house um, as much. You know, I do like the surface cleaning, but, um, you know, I kind of start, when I get really overwhelmed, I start taking things off my list. And um, that's kind of, and then like I'll slowly gain it back on. You know, I'll slowly start cleaning again, getting back to my videos. Um, it's all um, taking that time for you, which is hard for me. So um, I get it. I'm here. But yeah, let's start cleaning. And hopefully this gives you lots of cleaning motivation. Let you know that, you know, other people are out there struggling too. And uh, we all got this. We all can do it. We all got this. And let's stick together. All right, let's start cleaning.
so we cleaned out our basement and we were getting rid of a couple things and when we get rid of things we start piling them up in our sunroom and then I can slowly go through to see if I want to keep it for a yard sale or if we want to just donate it or whatever um, but we pile it in our sunroom and as you can see that sunroom is packed so that is actually recorded and I will get that video out for you guys to see that but yeah our sunroom is our like our catch-all area and it was it, it's it's pretty rough right now so that video is definitely coming but anyways to clear out this kitchen I just moved everything in there for now just so I can clean the space of our house Before I really start cleaning my kitchen, I like to put all the dishes away. So like in our drying racks and stuff. So I like to empty all that out, get all those put in their home so then I can clean under the drying racks and clean the drying racks if need be as well. So I like to get all the dishes put away, all the clean dishes put away before I really start cleaning. Now that the dishes are put away, I can go ahead and start from either left to right or right to left. Today I'm starting right to left just because my sink's more down there and it's still pretty cluttered down there. So I wanted to start off on this side of the kitchen first. And that is definitely giving my stove here a good scrub. So when I clean my stove, I usually like to just take a sponge with just soap and water to start off with. Um, I usually, usually I use a cleaning sponge. Sometimes I use my regular sponge. Um, I know some people think that's gross, um, but whatever. I mean, I'm just using soap on it and it's food. It's like I'm washing a dish. So anyway, so right now I'm just using a cleaning sponge, just some soap on there. And um, I scrubbed all that away. Next, to give it a little bit of shine and just to polish it off, I just use my um, multi-purpose spray, spray that. I use my um, microfiber towel there and just give everything a nice wipe down. And it gives it a nice shine, gives a nice finished clean look, and that's what I'm going for. So that's how I clean my stovetop. It always amazes me how dirty our dish rack gets. So I'm going to just give this a good wipe down as well and finish up with the counters here. Like I was saying in the beginning of my video, I really like wanted to keep up with my channel and keep it going and not take any breaks, but life did get busy. Life just started getting too chaotic and, um, you know, my channel was what I decided to put on the back burner for now. Um, and it's just so funny because I was trying to get this video out like mid January, the one that you guys are watching right now. And I, 
okay the kids got sick now i got sick and like now we're like into the second week of february here so i'm praying i could get this out um for this friday which would be I don't know, the 9th, the 10th. Um, so we'll see. We'll see what time I actually can finish up this video and get this out. I don't know if you can hear still in my voice. I am still a little sick. I ended up going to the doctors to get a antibiotic um, because I just couldn't shake this cold. So is it an antibiotic? I think it's an antibiotic. <laughs> so anyways, it's just crazy. Like life just really gets busy and then especially when you have little ones and they're into everything we started doing swimming and they're loving that and we have a lego land near us and the kids are obsessed with going and 100 percent, if you guys have a lego land near you get the membership that it, it's so worth it i mean at least the one near us there's like an indoor play pirate ship and it's like so cute the kids love it it's perfect for winter anyways i'm a big lego fan lego land fan <laughs> um and so are my kids so anyways we've just been busy going you know here and there um and we're barely home which is kind of nice because my home my house isn't getting as messy as it was when we were you know going to school and just coming home right away and the kids are playing and toys are everywhere and you know snack cups everywhere and whatever so anyways it's kind of nice having the schedule but at the same time finding time and um keeping up with things uh has definitely been harder sorry everyone so i just totally lost my train of thought because i have frozen on right now for my son while he's eating lunch and i am sitting here on the couch next to him recording and i just happen to look up at the screen because we never finish a movie i don't even know like we do but like it's very rare and i just completely forgot how frozen ended and she's like right now they're like in that and that forest and she's she's like has the visions of the past and they're like little ice sculptures or whatever and she's just watching them talk or whatever anyways totally got distracted because i completely forgot that this all happened <laughs> My friend and I always say if someone listened to our conversations, they probably think we're like crazy because we probably talk about five different things and we circle back to each thing like throughout. So we'll start off with one topic and be like, oh yeah, and this da 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 da, go back to the first topic, start a new topic, go back to the second, maybe the first. Anyways, our conversations are like all over the place and that's just how I feel like this video is going right now. So hopefully you guys are keeping up with me because I just feel all over the place um so right now i am doing the kitchen table here and um this ends up being like our catch-all it drives me crazy like i'll just dump everything here kids dump everything here um and it drives me nuts because i hate having uh the kitchen table full of stuff just especially for dinner time we definitely try to eat dinner all together so when it's packed full that's like the last thing i want to do after i cook dinner is clear off this table so I definitely have been slacking on keeping up with that, but um, we're going to get that done now and just find homes for everything. Oh, and it also snowed. Um, I don't know if I mentioned that earlier yet, but it also snowed. So we've been outside quite a bit too, like playing in the snow because it last time it snowed was probably two, three years ago for us. So that was a lot of fun for us to uh, go out and play. So I just have all the gloves and the hats and 
um, snow pants and all that fun stuff. So, um, just trying to find out where to put all that, uh, and get that all put back away. And that wall, I started taking off some of the kids' artwork as much as I love having their artwork up on the wall. I just used painter's tape to stick it up there. That's the blue tape there. Um, I got to start decluttering a little bit. There, It was just starting to get a lot of artwork up there. So, um, but I love having it displayed, but I have to make some room for new pieces. Now that I put all the clean dishes away, I wiped down the counters, wiped down stainless steel, wiped down the kitchen appliances, wiped, got our table cleared, wiped all that down. I'm going to go ahead and do our floors. And that is going to wrap up today's video. So I absolutely love my cordless vacuum here. This is the best thing I purchased for cleaning. I have it hanging on our wall in our kitchen there and I use this daily like if not once a day like I use it two three times a day between the living room the kitchen after meals whatever tracking and dirt I use this cordless vacuum quite a bit and I just love having it in the kitchen just because you know that's where I mainly need it is between the kitchen and our living room so um anyway so I'm going ahead and vacuuming that up first vacuuming everything first and then I'm gonna go ahead and use my um cordless vacuum mop so it does vacuum and mop um but just because I haven't to be completely honest with you guys I haven't done my floors like mopped my floors in a very long time like a month or two so um probably two three months maybe um whenever I was making videos last is probably the last time I was mopping my floors so um my floors are pretty dirty so I really wanted to give the machine um as much as uh as much as a head start there we go much as a head start as possible that's not really what i want to say i'm not really sure what i want to say but if you get my gist i really wanted to make sure i gave it as much of a i can't think of a word right now why can't i think of the word anyways i just really wanted to make sure it's working good so i wanted to vacuum first before i use this this machine that's going to drive me nuts. I can't figure out what word I'm trying to say. Anyways, um, just wait till you guys see. I'm going to show you guys the water and how dirty our water is Ooh, from this kitchen floor. My son is getting me with the PJ mask disc here. He's so cute. Um, that was a big thing for me is, you know, I felt like I wasn't playing with my kids at all when I was making all my videos and I really needed to take a step back and figure out that balance again because it was starting to get a lot for me and I was really missing playing with my kids so um that definitely weighs weighs on me
Look at that water. Oh my goodness. Guys, I could not believe how dirty our floor were, floors were. I ended up going ahead and doing it a second time because I couldn't believe how dirty the water was. This time I did it a lot faster the second round, so I really didn't use as much water as the first round, but the water was still dirty. All right, while I'm finishing that up, I just want to say thank you all so much for watching today's video. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you are new. I would love to hear from you all in the comment section. Let me know what your favorite part of the video is. And um, yeah, I have some videos coming up. I have cleaning out my sunroom, cleaning upstairs um, of our house. And yeah, I'm slowly starting to get all these videos back out to you guys. So again, it was great being on here. I'm so excited to be back and running. And uh, uh, yeah, don't forget to subscribe and thanks so much for watching. See you guys.